Alrighty folks, thanks for joining me on this one. I have two really cool things that I want to show you all. And the first one, I think, takes the cake for being the coolest. And let's look at it. I haven't even unboxed it. I haven't opened it at all whatsoever. I just saw it sitting um, on the porch. And so I can't wait to open this thing up. We're going to do it together. Because I wouldn't have this um, award, this thing that I have, if it weren't for all of you. It's been a lot of hard work, a lot of years in the making, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of videos and thousands and thousands of hours behind a computer and editing, just putting out content and thousands and thousands of hours of hunting and producing content and talking to this camera and talking to a lot of, uh, of you awesome people out there that support me in this channel. So here it is in the Bucky's chair in all its glory. We're doing this together. I'm so stoked. I've always wanted one of these, and I've always wondered what it would be like to receive one. And I gotta tell you, it feels uh, pretty incredible. Congratulations on your subscriber milestone. We are honored to take part in recognizing your achievement and want your experience to be exceptional. This award was inspected and packaged with great care by Rick. If your award was damaged during shipping, da, 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 if you have any questions, well, thanks, Rick. Sure, appreciate it. Do you remember your first subscriber, your hundredth, or your th thousandth? Chances are you do, and I most definitely do. And we know that you'll definitely remember your hundred thousandth, <laughs> for sure. Your fans may have found you while searching YouTube, learned about you through a friend, or maybe showed up as a recommended video. No matter how they came to your channel, your audience stayed and their numbers increased because of you and the community you've built. We're proud to honor your impressive milestone of reaching 100,000 subscribers with the Silver Creator Award. Congratulations. We know that you have many more stories to share with your community, and we know your fans can't wait for you to amaze them even more with your commitment and creativity. So keep creating, keep building. We can't wait to see what you'll do next, and we're here to support you along the way. And who knows, when you reach your millionth subscriber, we may just write to you and ask, do you remember your hundred thousandth? Neil Mohan, Mohan, however you say that, you're sincerely head of YouTube, and that's pretty, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> Presented to 4B Outdoors for, oh, it's shiny. Can't even see it, really in the shop with crappy lighting and a sideways camera. So it's definitely not how I intended on doing this uh, reveal of the plaque 100 of 100,000 subscribers. It's pretty awesome. I have to be honest, uh, words can't describe my thanks and my appreciation and my gratitude to each and every one of you for choosing to hit that subscribe button. I know there are a lot of you that still watch to this day that were here when I had less than a thousand, less than two thousand, less than five thousand subscribers and I want to say a huge thank you to you guys and just as importantly to the ninety eight thousandth person uh, to the two people that made it a hundred thousand um, I really and sincerely appreciate each and every one of you truly and honestly I never thought about the the plaque or the views or the the money uh, none of that. I never thought about it. I've just always loved and enjoyed producing and bringing content to all of you. Since doing YouTube, I have traveled to different places across the world and I've made some of my best friends in the world. Without YouTube, uh, I really, truly, I wouldn't have two or three or four of uh, some of the very good friends that I have. So I'm thankful for this platform. I'm thankful for this entire community, which is all of you, regardless of how little the views are and how little the money is and, and things like that. I'm still going to produce content on this channel because it's what I love to do. I love entertaining you guys. I love producing content that y'all enjoy watching. None of the other stuff matters. This channel brings me so much joy in the producing and the sharing of the content. The interaction with all of you, the broadhead testing, the hunting, the editing, it all brings so much joy to me. and. To be honest with you, I don't know where I would be um, in my life at this current point without uh, YouTube and without the this channel and the taking off of this channel. It has really blessed me a lot in my life, and this platform has been a way for me to share my hunts, but also more importantly, share the Word of God, and that is huge, and it means the, it means so much to me. It really does. So I hope for those of you that if you're sitting on the fence and you're not sure whether or not you're gonna uh, hit the subscribe button. 
Um, I hope that you do. This is a, a genuine channel, and the content is produced by me and my wife, and we have a blast doing this together. And I'm 100% telling you the truth when I say that if this was about the money and the views and the fame or whatever, which I don't see myself as a famous person at all, but if it was about all those things, uh, I would have quit a long time ago. The commitment that I've had to this channel over the years and producing weekly, um, sometimes multiple videos a week uh, as far as content goes, it is my passion. I love filming my hunts, my fishing trips, uh, everything um, that I do. I love and enjoy it thoroughly, producing it and putting it out there for you guys. And I hope that uh, you guys will continue to watch and watch more and share the videos and we can continue to grow as a community I love this channel and I love all of you guys so thank you once again now on to the second thing I know this intro is dragging out but we've got a couple of really cool things going on here I got a little sidetrack last night in the filming of this video back here now so we can continue on this hunt took place at the Real McCoy Ranch if you guys want to hunt at the real mccoy ranch all the information uh price list and stuff like that will be down in the description below and so will several different points of contact uh to me so you guys can email me you can hit me up on social media and i can get you all booked in i'll be there as your personal guide we have a great time one of you guys uh, john murray as a matter of fact he decided he wanted to come on a ram slash hog hunt and <laughs> we got it done and it was awesome super stoked for him on his really nice ram and a couple of pigs so i'm gonna let that footage roll Put your hands on him. He's better than I anticipated. Oh yeah. How does that look? Tore up the fletch and Just a little bit. Not too shabby. Awesome. Woo! Yeah, he didn't stand a chance. <laughs> Awesome. That's going to be such a cool mount. Look how close he grows to his face. That is too cool. That is awesome. Came out, look, broke that leg. Sure enough. when he pulled it off like that, I'm like, oh, Gee. That was a little bit, a little bit to the right. I was aiming right here. A little bit off. 
He's quartering away pretty hard. Came through perfect. Hit it around the heart. Yep. Right out the leg. And I'm still amazed at how close that is right there. That's on his face. <laughs> yeah. The taxidermist is going to have fun with that one. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Absolutely. <laughs> That's pretty dang cool. Yeah, it is. Huh? That is awesome. <laughs> it's real cool, isn't it? I ain't never done nothing like that before. I've only killed pigs. <laughs> and it don't happen like that all the time. No. <laughs> it's never that easy. I promise you that. Yeah. I thought, I, thought, uh, I thought you heard me. I said, I got him over here. Oh, no, I didn't hear you. <laughs> Solid shot. There you are, brother. I wonder where that arrow went. It's probably yeah. out there in the road. Probably skipped, double, yeah. Went through them oh, lungs. That, that, I'm surprised that dude ran as far as he did. Uh, me too. So he must have come in right here, so he went in further No, ahead. he came from over there. He came from over there, John. And he ended up over there. I yeah. already drug him about 50 yards. Oh, okay. But I stopped because I thought, well, maybe, you know. Perfect. Maybe I do want to do some video. Congratulations, sir. Thank Absolutely. You. <laughs> I'm glad we got one, finally. Yeah. What was that, the G5? Yeah, the uh, Montec 3. Montec 3, all right. Good right job. on. Double O? Yep. Yeah, solid Pretty shot. Perfect shot. Textbook. We're facing to get drenched. Yeah, yeah, we better roll. It's down. raining and thundering and lightning. <laughs> Check that cloud out. Look at that wall. Wow. One piggly wiggly and some nice rain coming in. We had a great weekend with John. We're so thankful to him for coming out and uh, creating a new friendship with us. We really enjoyed the fellowship and the time spent together in camp. And we're most certainly looking forward to having him back. And as I said, if any of you guys want to come down and put a hunt together and have me in camp as your guide and film your hunt and all that great stuff, then we can make it happen. And we always enjoy it and have a great time. And I think that a lot of you will uh, have the same experience. I think y'all will really like it. Here's to a million, and thank you to the first 100,000. Each and every one of y'all are awesome, and I can't thank you enough for being here, being a part of this community. I really appreciate each and every one of y'all, and I'll see you in just a few days.